Hello, my name's Corey. I'm just making a quick video to explain the importance and kind of the opportunities that you can use with Developer Console. A couple of people brought up buy binds and stuff um, in the in the Reddit post that I made. So here's a quick tutorial of how to do it uh, because it's easier than having to write something out and I can actually demonstrate. So basically, this is Developer Console. You enable this in your settings. Um, and you in your game settings and you can use this to change both server variables and client variables uh, amongst other things so SV underscore cheats one will enable cheats in the server that is the server variable so now I can no clip oh if I spell it right like this and then turn it off and if I turn SV underscore cheats to zero I can no longer I can no longer no clip because cheats are off. Um, so I'll show you quickly how to do buy binds and I will link uh, basically the the weapons or whatever they are in the game settings. I'll, I'll link that in the video description because some of them can be a bit uh, tricky. So how you bind something is you type bind and then whatever key you want to use so I'll do F1 and then I'll open quotations I'll write buy AK47 semicolon by M4A4. Close that, hit enter and then when I press F1 it buys me an M4 and AK. Uh, once again I'll link that stuff in the bottom because like Kevlar's vest helm and or vest depending on if you want a helmet and stuff and some of them are just a bit tricky so I'll, I'll just link that. Um, but this allows you to not only buy weapons faster but also you can drop people um, by say for example if I wanted, if I had this up, and I wanted to impulse 101, which will give me money. If I want, oh, SV underscore cheats one, impulse 101, that's how you get extra money. Um, but if I had this up and I wanted in matchmaking to drop someone an M4, because I'm nice, um, I can throw it up in the air, oh, and then drop that. I can drop that, and that will mean that someone doesn't pinch my. My, my AWP on me. So it can be used to stuff like that. It can be used for just buying fast. Um, instead of having to kind of go through all this and kind of think what you want, like diffuse get there, I can just buy it by pressing F4. Which. There. Buy diffuser. So that's basically an example of how buy binds and different console commands can, can change things. Another example that you might immediately notice on my screen is that I've got an FPS counter. How you do that is net underscore graph one, and that'll tell you basically uh, how the game is running. So yeah, that's that's about everything. See you guys.